Lenz, Kravinkina and Azurian. So to get us underway, the couple from the Czech Republic lying in 19th place. Uh, this is 19-year-old Camilla Hakova and 22-year-old David Vincor. Lovely position in the lay back left. A lot of speed into the midline step sequence. in the spin sequence sort of a bit of a bit of a strange entry into that but it flowed well once they got going oh, a very good change of music for the diagonal step sequence Fabulous, really enjoyed that. Loads of energy in there and uh, they really got into the mood right from the off. Camila Akova, David Vinkor from the Czech Republic. And there's a star of the future, Nikki. Tango, dancing. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Don't care if it's tango, I'm dancing. Well, I like that, it's sharp. Um, good quality of skating. And I like the way the overall original was put together, the whole shape of it, the way that the music changed, the way it fitted the different elements. She was just losing forward momentum on the end of the second set of her twizzles. But uh, as is the, the game, she managed to cover it up very well. You see they're out of sync there. And whilst it looks a little bit, and she stopped and lost the flow over the ice at the end. So compared to couples that maintain the momentum and the speed, they will get a lower technical score. And you think we're being picky, but just if you could hear those technical people looking, that's their job and that's what they do. Very nice down at the end to change position for the, the spin. There were times when, to me, they missed a trick in technical content. The straight line step sequence started off very strongly, then the middle of it was a little empty before the twizzles as they got themselves prepared. That's the last lift, six seconds, and it has to be down. So, giving it all they can. And I thought, I thought some of the tango content with the flicks of the feet was good. 
Yeah, they really had attitude, didn't they? They did, and that sharpness was. It's good to see. Slav Sinitsin. Well, these two changed coaches just uh, very late last year. In fact, uh, November. So getting close to the sea where you're in the middle of the season, it's a strange time to uh, make a change like that. Yeah, always a difficult decision. Sometimes the, the couple's changing and lots of factors. But it can give you an energy as well. It, it, can, it can put more pressure on you to get things done quicker. So you might even listen, listen to your coach more <laughs> than you used to. <laughs> so uh, those scores, good enough to put them into sixth place. Remember, we've had, uh, what have we had now? 13 skaters have gone so far out of the 27. So sixth 